Sunshine's Quality Assured Collisions Weekly Bite is sponsored by Sunshine's Quality Assured Collision. Hey everybody, welcome <laughs> back to the show. These two were just doing jumping jacks. They were so excited about this segment. Light Calisthenics with Bob Bloomer. It's his new show. He, of course, TV host, chef, and author. How joining are you? us now. How are you, Bob? Thank you. Thank you for Pleasure coming to be today. here. Nice to be here on Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Day. And I love you guys so much. It's just appropriate. <laughs> well, we love you too. And what are we doing today? We're making delicious snacks. We're making the everyday special on Valentine's Day. We are making Day. the everyday special. And you know, it is Valentine's Day. And if uh, you had your act together, maybe you already made someone special breakfast in bed. But if you mm -hmm. didn't, every weekend should be Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day, right? Well, every, I, every Sunday morning. That, well done. Just for me. Way, way to set the standard for everybody out there, Bob, to make it all special. But you can keep it simple and it still can be special. Totally. I'm going to show you how to make some really special stuff with some yummy bagels okay. in like five minutes or less. Okay, beautiful. Where, are we gonna, uh, where do you want to start? We'll start down here on the left. Okay. Okay. The nice people at Dempster's have just rolled out their brand new recipe for bagels, which is, uh, their, the recipe is nice and crispy on the outside, fluffy on the inside, fewer calories. As a bagel should be. As, As a bagel be. should be. And uh, so to celebrate that, I've created four different toppings for them, one for each of the different kinds of bagel-loving personalities. All right. Okay. And, I see uh, peanut butter, so that's going to be where I live. I, I know think. I live here. Yeah, I'm Forbes. Peanut is going butter to be and coconut. coconut. Okay. Yeah. Well, first of all, I'm going to show you how to make the take the classic ingredients, so cream cheese and smoked salmon. But I'm going to show you how to put it together in a way that's going to add lots of extra bonus flavor. Okay, we like and, extra bonus um, flavor. And also, the nice thing about this is you can do it once at the beginning of the week, and then you can smear your bagels with it all week nice. long. Nice. Convenience. Excellent. All right, so. Cream cheese in the food processor, a carefully measured amount of capers, <laughs> carefully measured amount of fresh dill. I like your style, Bob Bloomer. Bloomer. <laughs> Couple of green onions. Not That's his chopping. next show. His next show is actually called Careful Measure. <laughs> a little bit of black pepper. And lastly, well, second to lastly, but for now, lastly, some lemon zest. And you know what I love about lemon zest? What do you love about lemon zest? You know how much lemon zest costs? Nothing? Nothing! <laughs> yes! You know what? With the lemon. It's free, yeah, it, it comes is. with the lemon. And then after you finish using it, you uh you know you still have the lemon to squeeze. So you're just gonna throw this in your little handy dandy food processor. Handy -dandy. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're just gonna zip this up a bit, right? Okay. A little pulsing. And then we're gonna put our smoked salmon in oh, here. Holla. Like ah. this. But the reason I'm putting the smoked salmon in at the end is so that I can sort of maintain a bit of what I like to call the integrity of it. Yeah, right. you want to have the texture cool. too. What kind of bagel are we going to have with this one? Because there's so many flavors. Well, for this one, you want to have it all. Like this is the, everything? put everything in. Yeah, <laughs> Yeah, those are my favorite bagels. I always go for the everything because I can't decide. All right, so see how we have all the yummy yeah. ingredients here. Perfect. You can still see the smoked salmon, the capers and all that, but it's all chopped up. So we're going to take our everything bagel. Yes. And here's my dirty little secret about bagels. When it comes to bagels and cream cheese, we all have a dirty oh. little secret. I always add always. Now, this is just my own. It better. Really? <laughs> even even with the cream cheese. You know what? Cream cheese is isn't as moist, and the butter just sort of moistens up the bagel. So and it's then a nice bed, a nice little bed for the the cream cheese to go on the bagel. Exactly. Oh. Exactly. I like the way you guys roll, man. That's so decadent. <laughs> usually, I'm the fairly decadent one in all this. You usually are. Uh, yeah. While you're plugging away, we want to talk just really briefly because you've been working on a new show, uh, as you are wont to do. And you are traveling the world for this one and going to some pretty crazy places. I am. It's called World's Weirdest Restaurants, and it's exactly like it sounds. I travel to all these crazy restaurants all over the world. We're talking about rest like an izakaya in uh, Tokyo, or just outside of Tokyo, yeah. in Japan, where macaque monkeys bring you your beer. See, that sounds amazing <laughs> to me. Like a real monkey hops over to and your table. And did you really eat out of a toilet? Uh, in Taiwan, in a restaurant called Modern Toilet. <laughs> Mo it's called Modern Toilet. <laughs> yes, and, and you know, you think, well, maybe there's just a few crazy Taiwanese who like this. It's a franchise. You're kidding me. You're so kidding me. <laughs> you got to bring it here. Mike loves eating out of the toilet. <laughs> All sorts of crazy things. In fact, it debuts on April 4th, and I'll be back in town just before that. Well, we're going to have you back. And we'll I'm save the rest of the story. See if I can stuff. bring one of those toilet bowls with Please me. Please do. Bring one of the monkeys. I like that more. It's like an opening scene from Planet of the Apes. <laughs> totally. Right? Like, that's it where it begins. just brings you a beer. Now, because it's still Valentine's Day, watch this. So we're just taking... <gasps> a look at this. Danger, Bob. People. Danger. Oh, a little heart. That is just adorable. Look at that. It's just all the hard work is already done for us. Aww. <laughs> Mother I Nature loves you. About that. Hiding a couple more down here. Throw them on there and look. Aww. You take that A bagel in bed? made with love. There you, you go. You might even get lucky that. with this, Michael. All right, into bed, Forbes. Let's see how this Gross. works. <laughs> there we so go. All the over recipes into the Fiona that I created, all these over here, um, 
well, the four of them, for yeah. each of the different bagel personalities are on facebook.com slash Dempsters. Okay. See, that's okay. tremendous. So, this is, I, I'm really, I'm very, very fortunate. I get to travel a lot. And um, if I'm not traveling for my show, I'm doing other crazy things. Right. I was just in Vietnam, and I was recently in Thailand as well. So I took two of my favorite sort of flavor combinations, one from Vietnam, the peanut, uh, the chili peanut sauce. Yeah. And then in Vietnam, you know, they serve banh mi, these amazing sandwiches with mm -hmm. a little bit of pate, mm -hmm. and yeah. then some fresh vegetables on yeah. top. So I'm going to show you really fast how to do this. It is so simple, uh, yet so flavorful. See, so, uh, this looks amazing to me already. You've got ginger, chili, lime, and peanut butter. You know, I've always said, you buy the right ingredients, and they do all the hard work for right. you. So we're starting with peanut butter off the rack. You can just use, uh, you can use whatever, 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 uh, crunchy, plain, then smooth, smooth, and then some freshly grated ginger. Wow. A That's little bit of water. freshly grated coconut. So I'm combining two things. One is like a, a spicy Thai peanut sauce. Yeah. And then, you know, coconut and anything Thai goes together. Yeah, totally. This is like the perfect, it's an in-between. It's in between yours and mine. Aww. Mine's a peanut butter, yours <laughs> coconut. A little freshly Bob, squeezed no one so well. lime juice, a little chili pepper flake. That smells really that. good. <laughs> <laughs> that. That did not work no, well enough. That did not work well. <laughs> I like your style, though. Okay, Damn what you kind of bagel? Damn you, floppy spatula. Okay, so we've got do. all these flavors. What kind of bagel are we going to put this okay, guy on? Okay, we're going to put this on a sesame what? bagel. Because okay. it's you know, it's sesame. Very traditional, mm -hmm. very, mm -hmm. very simple. Okay, so Just we're like Michael. Peanut That's butter half. schmear. Just throw it. You load it up, you too. You are aggressive on the topping. I know, but you got to well, have you know, it. This is for what uh, the bagel barometer determined was an energizer. Those are the people who like it. bagel Don't you have one in your backyard? <laughs> the bagel oh, of course. I'll hook you, I usually I'll, hang it on the wall. I'll but... hook you guys up. Okay, cool. Uh, so, uh, <laughs> so this is for the energizer who likes to jumpstart their day with their bagel and then have it carry, like, fuel them all the way to lunch. Because you've got the protein, you got a little bit of sweet, and then you've got this exactly. chilies in there. What are you putting on okay, top? Okay, so this, this is, is a marriage of cultures. That's Napa what this cabbage. Is. So this is like from the banh mi. So Napa cabbage. Yeah, a little, little bit of bit color. Of this beautiful red cabbage. Why do they call this red cabbage? It's purple. It's purple. Is it not purple? I know, because they're okay. stupid, clearly. A little bit of It's carrot. the red cabbage cabal. That's who's done it. <laughs> and then, not that I'm paranoid, and then, but. A little bit is, of mint. A little mint. So these are all, you know, again, classic Thai. That's brilliant. Mm -hmm. I would I'm take in. a bite of that, but I'm going to be talking to a beautiful model after this. And I, I don't want <laughs> <laughs> Mike, you're already going to embarrass yourself. Oh, Just do it. Oh, so well, we're going to see you back in April because he's got a brand new show right, uh, that starting in April called World's Weirdest Restaurant. Say that 10 times fast. And of course, uh, if you want to find out more about the delicious bagel recipes we've been doing today, we only did half of them, you can go to the Facebook page for Dempsters, or you can also go to Bob's website to find out about his cookbook and everything everything else, bobbloomer.com. Delicious, thank you. My pleasure. We're going to take a break. Thank you a lot, Bob. Can we stick around and help you with this, Bob? Oh, yeah. I think so. Thank you. We're going to help you. We'll be right back after this. We'll go away.